Hey guys, this is Juno with Detour Shirts with another quick tip in Affinity Designer. Today we're gonna learn about gradients and how to do them. It's super simple in Affinity Designer and gradients can help your t-shirt stand out. See this t-shirt right here with the gradient? And I did some gradients here on this artboard. You can see I did a vintage sunset gradient and even gradients on text. So it's easy to do. Let me show you how to do it. So all you need to do is click the objects that you wanna put a gradient on. So you can see each of these are separate objects here on the layer palette. If I just select all of them, I can put a gradient through the whole thing. So you wanna select all of them and then click on this tool right here. It's called the fill tool. You can also hit G, click on this and we're gonna go from this one, this top one you can see there's two dots, the top dot and the bottom dot. As you click them, they get a little bigger. So the top dot, let's make a color. Let's pick this cyan and maybe some magenta in there. And you can see it now it's going from a gradient from that color that we picked down to white because the default is white. And when I click on here, you can see it is defaulted by white. And I'm going to choose yellow. So I'm just pulling it like that. And you can see now it's going from that kind of a blue color to that yellow color. And then there's green in the middle because, you know, yellow and blue make green. But if I want to put a different color here, let's say I want to put uh, red here. You can do that. Put a magenta there or a red like that. So you can add as many colors on this line as you want. If I click here again, I can change this color, right? If I click here again, I can add another color. Isn't that cool? So you can add as many as you want. Just be careful not to add too many because then it could look funny. So if you want to remove the color, just click on that dot that you have selected and hit backspace or delete. Delete on this one and you could have two, three colors, however many you want. Same thing with the text. So click on the text, drag it like this and click on the top dot. You can see that one's bigger. Let's make that yellow and click on this one. Let's make that cyan. And we got, let's make this white in the middle. Boom. Easy to do like that, right? And if you want to come back in and adjust the colors, maybe you want that yellow not so dark, click on it again right there. And you can see I can take the yellow down again. So super easy to do. That's how you do gradients in Affinity Designer. You can put it on multiple objects. You can put it on text can do it with anything. So hopefully this video is really helpful for you to learn how to do that. Thanks again for watching this video. And the question of the day is this, is there anything in Affinity Designer that you would like to know how to do? Leave that in the comments. Thanks again for watching. And as always guys, keep creating and keep learning. I'll see you on the next one.